Hello guys and welcome to my channel. It is your boy Stocky here and guys it's the year 2020 and I finally bought a PlayStation Vita. Guys I got two of them for around 120 US dollars and this is the PlayStation Vita Slim. I got this one and I transferred the buttons from this one to the other one because this one is a much better game. I got a 16 GB memory card as well and Killzone Mercenaries. Guys it's really fun. I've already modded these Vitas. I've got a few games in them. I got um, all the files that I need. Encore, got Package J, Vita Shell, Switch View. The only thing I hate about the Vita is the menus. So I wish we could have installed this one menu by, what's there, what they name it? One second guys. I really like the one menu for the PlayStation Vita. If we had a better, um, let's say, a better um, user interface, out of out of love the PlayStation Vita, but guys. This isn't so bad. We also got Switch View. Let me launch Switch View for you guys. And this looks like a Nintendo Switch. Not a bad look, but guys, I much rather it looks like the PlayStation 4 launcher. But this ain't bad for. The Vita. I only wish this could have been permanent. So I've already, I've been running Hencore on 3.68. Let me show you guys my system version. I've got 3.68 on Encore. I also got Adrenaline installed. And there's one thing I hate about Adrenaline is that games don't run in native resolution for the PlayStation Vita. They run in the PSP's um. PSP's resolution. Let's launch the PSP mode on the PlayStation Vita. I don't think I have any PSP games on this. I was playing some games earlier, but I've reserved the PlayStation PSP games for the the other PlayStation Vita that I got. This analog right here isn't working, so guys, I'm gonna have to replace that. The X button also is stuck, so I'll have to resort, re replace that button board as well and I'll be replacing the housing. As you can see, there are some scuffs, there's some cracks right here. We've got some other imperfections on the back, so I'll be changing both the back and the front of both these PlayStation Vitas. On this one, I got four gigabyte memory card, and this is the one that I have Killzone Mercenaries inside as well. So let's put this back over there, and as you, as you can see, this is a very beautiful Blizzion Vita. I got FIFA 14, Call of Duty Black Ops, the Classified, Need for Speed Most Wanted, and Killzone Mercenary. The only reason why I play the PlayStation Vita is because I love the PlayStation 4 remote play. I use the PlayStation 4 remote play a lot for playing FIFA 20 or doing SBCs and among those other things. I also got Package J to get all my Vita games for free. As you can see right here, Package J, we also, there's a, you can get any Vita game for free as long as you will use Package J. And yeah guys, that's it. There isn't much to show you guys. I'm a FIFA fan, so I play FIFA a lot on my PlayStation Vita. I got the FIFA 20 modded. I'll be doing a video on that soon. And yeah guys, Vita is fun. I, I got, I don't think I have a lot of plugins installed, but let me see what I've got installed for you guys. Let's load. We got plugins for Vita. Um, uninstall plugins. We got three three plugins. We got um, the no DP PRM and no non PDRM, and we got music premium, so I can play music in the background of my games. And yeah, guys, that's it. As you can see with this Vita, it also got some scuffs, got some imperfections as well. I took this analog from the other Vita. This analog is a lot better, but it doesn't have the rubber on it. And back is also not the best as well. Guys, thank you guys so much for supporting my channel. If you need my channel, please be sure to hit the subscribe button down below if you want to see some gameplay videos on the PlayStation Vita. Just tell me in the comment section down below. As I say to you guys, thank you so much for watching. Peace out, guys, and bye bye.